Good evening, everyone. Thanks for joining us on this Friday night. On the campaign trail tonight for one local candidate, the campaign he says is hitting a little bit too close to home for him, literally. Republican Rick Gudak says his home was vandalized, and he says it's not the first time that it's happened. Gudex is running against Democratic incumbent Jessica King for state Senate. Fox 11's Alex Ranallo has tonight's balanced coverage. In this Fond du Lac neighborhood, political signs are a common sight, especially at Rick Gudex's house. But uh, today they're not lined up, obviously. Gudex's signs are in his yard instead of on his fence because his home was vandalized. You know, this is my property, and my kids sleep upstairs. My wife is here. Um, you know, that's a little uncomfortable and it's a little too much. And it's not just the signs. Parts of his landscaping were knocked over and his American flag was turned upside down. My flag is up in honor of this country and in honor of all the veterans that, that serve this country. This is not the first time Goodex's house has been vandalized. Early on in his campaign, he found his garage and his son's truck completely covered in eggs. And then there was the campaign signs getting damaged and cut up. It's up to four incidents now, which the police are investigating. But Gudex says it doesn't intimidate him. Just determines me and makes me move forward even faster and harder. Gudex says he does not think his opponent, Democratic State Senator Jessica King, or her staff had anything to do with the vandalism. In a statement, King said she does not condone intimidation, trespassing, or vandalism of any kind, and that she is committed to running a positive campaign. Both candidates agree politics could use more positivity right now. Goodex says he thinks the negative political atmosphere could play a part here. It just fosters an climate where people get upset. For his part, Goodex says he's not very upset with the people responsible. He says he just wants it to stop. Um, it's fine, but, um, you know, just please respect other people's property and their privacy. In Fond du Lac, Alex Ranallo, Fox 11 News. Now, in the meantime, Goodex says he's planning to add a video camera to his property as a form of security.